Hello, my name is Chance Perdomo, and I'm here with, no, my name's Chance Perdomo from the Chilling Adventures of Sabrina, and I am with Seventeen Magazine today, and what we're doing, we're doing blind date, celebrity blind date. What that means is, I hide behind a curtain in that room, and a fan comes along, and we have a blind date, so to speak. Come check it out. I'm Caitlin, and I am a Chilean Adventures of Sabrina super fan. I just wish I had witch power, so that's why I love it. Originally, when I heard that I could be in this video, I thought, oh my gosh, I have an opportunity to channel my inner Sabrina, so this is my hair even. I want to be her, so that's why I have my headband, just trying to be Sabrina. My favorite character is Sabrina, but I also love Jazz Sinclair, so she's an awesome one too. When season two came out, I devoted my entire night to watching all of it, except I had to cut myself off right before the finale because it was 3 a.m. and then I finished it the next morning. <laughs> I think dating someone based on a TV show is a great way to have common interests and compatibility. And I think some relationships can sustain <laughs> and last longer just because you have that common interest. Am I nervous? I am quite anxious uh, to uh, not spoil the surprise and not fall over in the chair, look behind the curtain, None of that, none of that stuff. Might put on an accent or two, or five. Hello, my name is Chance Perdomo, and we're doing Celeb Blind Date. Hello, my name is Chance Perdomo, and we're gonna be doing Blind Date today. Hello, my name is Chance Perdomo, we are doing a Blind Date today, huh? Hi. Hey. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm doing well, thank you. K is your name? Yes. Well, I'm C, and it's lovely to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Would you rather live in Greendale or Riverdale? I would live in Greendale because everybody there is so hot. Amazing answer. I would also live in Greendale. Why? Because I just think it's a cooler time and all the magic <laughs> is cool. It's magical, isn't it? It's magical. <laughs> Would you rather go to Baxter High or Academy of the Unseen Arts? I would say Baxter High because I'm not a fan of cannibalism. <laughs> what about you? True, true. I think it would be a lot easier to go to Baxter High, but I think it's more fun at the Academy of Unseen Arts. And I think if I was going there, that would mean I would be a witch, so. What kind of familiar would you have? I would have a mouse, kind of like Ambrose. I just like just his vibe, you know? That's a hard one for me because I don't like cats, <laughs> even though I love Sabrina. But, and there's not really any dog familiars, it seems like, on the show, so maybe like- Parrots? A wolf, oh, a parrot, oh. maybe. A wolf. Can you have a better. fish? I know that wouldn't do much for you. A goldfish. That seems easy. If you had the chance, would you sign your name in the Dark Lord's book? Depends on the weather. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say no, that's terrifying. <laughs> Which character on Chilling Adventures of Sabrina is your favorite and why? Harvey Kinkle, because Ross is such a babe. <laughs> Sabrina, obviously. <laughs> Why Sabrina? Like? Because she's so, I don't know, she reminds me of myself sometimes. Um, because oh, so she's you're fierce always, too. Yes, I'm fierce and she's always usually right. <laughs> Would you rather take part in the Lupercalia or just go to a normal Valentine's Day dance? Lupercalia, minus the wolves. Ditto. If you could teach any subject at the Academy of Unseen Arts, what would you teach and why? Conjuring, because I can conjure anything I want into existence. Very cool. Like the law of attraction, like, uh, like, um, like the secret. Yourself? Um, I think the potions. Have you seen all of season two yet? I've seen some of it. Yeah, so one of the episodes made me think that would be pretty cool. I won't give it away, it'd be a spoiler alert. Are you more team Habrina or team Nabrina? Well, I, I swear, like, the uh, the warlocks and witches are, like, older than they seem. So isn't Nick, like, in his 50s or something? And, like, she's, like, 16? That's a... Uh, I'm gonna go with Harvey. I think I'm Nabrina after season two, actually. But to be determined. If you were stuck in your house, what are three things you would need to not get bored? My dogs. Um, kombucha. And a TV. Netflix, <laughs> um, <laughs> any type of book, and yeah, a dog would be nice. Kombucha is life. Kombucha is life, but <laughs> it's not that entertaining. <laughs> what is your biggest fear? Not pursuing my heart and my dreams. I'm afraid of heights, like falling to my death. 
but not I like being up high, I like roller coasters and stuff, but. You're a daredevil, huh? I guess. How good are you at keeping secrets? Better than keeping my glasses. I'm a bad secret keeper, kind of. Uh-oh. <laughs> I have a lot of secrets. <laughs> if you were in trouble, which character would you call to help you out? Sabrina, because of her powers, for sure. Same, definitely. Actually, though, her aunt is like always saving her, so. But which one? Uh, oh, both of them, maybe both aunts. I want to pick two people. What is a fun fact about you most people don't know? I'm from England, but I was born in LA. How are you from England and born in LA? Well, I was raised in the UK, but my mom is from New York, but had me in LA. Where are you from? Are you Irish? No, I'm from Des Moines, Iowa. <laughs> Des Moines, Ireland? Exotic. Ireland? No, Iowa. Where's Iowa? In the middle of the country. Like? The Midwest. Cl close to Nebraska? Yes, very close to Nebraska. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. <laughs> what is your biggest texting pet peeve? Hashtag a breeze. Fair. I don't like when people say, just K. Like your name? Yeah, like my name. It's okay if it's saying it as my name, but just like K. I would go on a date with this person. Seems like we'd have a lot of fun and laugh a lot. I would go on a date with K. You nervous? A little bit. <laughs> me too, me too. Hi! Hi. Oh my god! Okay. <laughs> You said you were, where you were from, but oh my god, this is literally the best thing ever, guys. I love you. This is so. I'm gonna cry. It's so good to meet you. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay. What's your actual name? Caitlin. Caitlin. Yes. Yes. You, Caitlin. Nice to meet you. Thanks for coming over here. She. Uh, Sabrina. Has. You look similar. I don't know where where I where I know you from. Mm. Maybe maybe from Greendale, perhaps. Great great thing to say. Thank you so much. I don't know. No, thank this is crazy. You. Thank you. We need some music to like dance or something. <laughs> Maybe a little bit, a little bit of that. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking it might be him, and then when I saw him, I was like, no way. I, I really. When you first came out, I was confused. I was like, this person talks kind of weird. No offense. No worries. Um, and but I was like, when you said you were like from England, also I was like, okay. And when you didn't know where Iowa, Iowa was, that was funny. So Nebraska. I figured that. Yeah, I figured that you weren't from here. <laughs> awesome. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this, subscribe to 17's YouTube channel.